he couldn't be torn away from him. So, what are we eating? Um, um, what are you eating? Chicken nuggets and french fries, right? Yeah. And I am having a double quarter pounder with ketchup and mayonnaise. <laughs> I never eat that. So currently, I'm the only one in my family doing keto. I made my family hot dogs tonight. Nice, cheap, a nice cheap uh, meal. So I can't eat this, right? Keto I'm gonna show you what I do. I am keto diamond. That's right. My grandbaby's calling out keto diamond. I am frying up me some all beef, uncured Oscar Mayer no. wieners <laughs> with some onions my and some coconut oil. Done. In a minute, I'm gonna add me some chili. And some shredded cheese and melt that all together. Hold on, I'm gonna show y'all Spider Baby. Spider Baby's done with what? Oh yeah, eating something you shouldn't be eating on my keto channel. <laughs> Ice cream sandwich. Did you wash your hands? Get back here, boy. All right, so I poured off most of the oil. Added my chili and cheese. I'm gonna let the cheese melt. And I'm gonna have me a bowl of uh, chili cheese dogs. Mm. Much love to y'all. Hit the like button. And subscribe. <laughs> my kids are about to taste my food. By the way, I put ketchup and mayonnaise in that too. Well, yes. Where'd you go? Yes. Good. What do you mean? Where did I go? I couldn't see. You don't even aim the camera at me. Uh, duck over this way then. Hi. Was it good? Yes, it was good. All right. Hey, 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 now. So I thought you guys would like to hear something funny. I just put chili in my ear. <laughs> Some chili fell on my earbud and I wasn't looking. And I stuck it in my ear and didn't realize it until after I'd done it. <laughs> Good morning, guys and dolls. Your favorite little keto goofball diamond back again. So today is my 448th day of keto. Well, minus a few here and there. But it's 448 days since I started keto. Uh, feeling good, feeling great, looking good. Just got out of the shower, haven't dried my hair all the way and haven't combed it yet either. Uh, I don't comb my hair when it's wet because I don't want to lose it all and it's thin enough. So anyway, I thought I would get on here real fast and show you a few things um, that we've done to the house. <clears throat> Voice issues. Guys, we just completely, we, we fell out of summer into winter. Somehow. Oh, no. It's all right. It's North Carolina. Tomorrow it'll be 90 again. But today is 35. Right now, anyway. <laughs> I sound rough. <clears throat> Hopefully I've got one of those rough, sexy voices people say they like. <laughs> I don't know. I don't. So anyway, I got a couple sweaters yesterday from Goodwill. Gonna show them to you. Because I had no winter clothes. Because for some dumbass reason... My stupid self, over the summertime, was going through my clothes. So, well, this is going to be too big this winter. This is going to be too big this winter. This is going to be too big this winter. And it all would have been, but I still could have wore it because I like oversized shirts, especially in the winter. Oh, no. My stupid ass threw them all away. Not threw them away. Donated them all. But still, same effect. I had no winter clothes. Had to go buy a few things. And while I was there yesterday, I told y'all I got that couch. I haven't picked it up yet. And now I have no idea where to flip and put it. Destiny yesterday, my daughter, like I said, moved out. My son and Destiny took her old room. So Destiny went and got a day bed that used to belong to her grandmother. And it's pretty. But it didn't fit in that room in any way she wanted to set it. So where she wanted her bed to set, the day bed was just too big for that area. So it ended up in the living room for Zach. Zach now has his own bed. Where the hell do I put the couch that I can't return? <laughs> it's a decent couch, so I'm going to get it anyway, sew the place, see if my mother will buy it for $20. If not, I'll give it to her anyway if she wants it. And if not, there's got to be a hidey hole somewhere in this little dump it'll fit in. Did a few things. Fixed my light switch last night. My um, back door light I showed you yesterday was broken. I'll show that in an update video for the house. But anyway, guys, let me show you this white sweater that I'm just, I'm vibing on. But I, I, I got to tell you, it's not going to last long. I don't know why I buy white. I like white. It looks good with my hair. But I'm going to ruin it first. 
<laughs> Got these at uh, Google a few months ago because my grandson thought I should have red sunglasses to match my truck. Unfortunately, my, my truck is more of a faded pink now, but hey, let me show you the sweater. I don't know where to put everything. <laughs> can you see? Y'all never can see me. Oh, Y'all know there's something wrong with me, right? I know ugh, that you can't see me. And uh, you probably ain't going to see me still. Look, let me try it. See what happens. There we go. My jeans are falling off my butt. It's annoying as hell. <laughs> but, it, you know, it's got this great sweater material, but the back is made a little bit different. It's still sweater material, but it's a thinner material. So it's kind of neat. And it's, it's shaped kind of cute. I like it. It's got, it's just, it's a perfect oversized sweater. Sorry. <laughs> Y'all know me. Anyway, let me get that other sweater on. I'll be right back. All right, you guys, here we go with this. As soon as it finishes, it's cooking. Grandbaby wants his pizza. This is one of those good, thick burgundy sweaters. It's one of the really soft, super soft materials. Uh, can y'all even see this? It looks really dark, but it's like a wine burgundy color. It's one of the super soft, silky ones. Um, but... I know me. It's going to be two degrees for me to wear this on a, a long-term basis. Don't play with the heater. Can I have to turn it back on so I can... Wait for my AC to heat again. Let me take the sweater off. Hold on, guys. Okay, you guys, now that I'm back in my cozy white sweater, I'll show you the grandbaby's new day bed, which turned out not to be such a good thing. His toy box was fit underneath. Yay. Uh, but anyway, there used to be two twin size beds sitting here making a big old king size and it was really hard to walk through this area <laughs> so now this is a lot better plus you can use it as a couch like thing i suppose but definitely need my new mattress this one is a terrible mattress it's so uncomfortable um but it's what we had to work with definitely gonna go get some sheets because i don't like red i like blue as you might be able to see something that matches that might actually start using this as one of my backgrounds um when i do videos I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, it's cute. It did backfire on me, though. I don't know how to explain. 